Hello and welcome to Sharp Smoker Electronic Cigarettes. In this video, I want to go over the Ego C Electronic Cigarette. So go ahead and slide it out. On top here, you can see you've got an Ego C user manual. So you want to be sure to flip through that and read it before you start using your electronic cigarette. Below that, we've got the five atomizer heads, which are these little guys right here. These are what actually produce the vapor for the electronic cigarette. And then you've got your five cartridges. Uh, these are tank cartridges, hold about one milliliter of e-liquid each. So we'll go ahead and uh, set those out here on the side. And then you've got your batteries, and also the uh, atomizer body. So we'll go ahead and take one of these out, and you can see here, uh, you've got, let's go ahead and unscrew the uh, atomizer body. And so what we got right here is the battery. Uh, you press the button, you see that it does not light up. Um, these batteries do come with a locking feature. All you got to do is press the button here five times rapidly. And you'll see it blink three times, and then when you press it, it'll light up. And that means that uh, your battery is ready to go and ready to use. The, um, then, of course, we got one more full unit right here, which we'll just set that aside. And then last but not least, we got the charger. Uh, you got the, uh, the wall adapter which you just plug the USB portion into here like that and then you would screw on your battery uh, onto here in order to charge your battery so basically just screws on just like that and then uh, you go plug it in and that would be charge your battery you can also can of course um, forgo the wall adapter and just use the USB portion and plug it into the uh, USB outlet on your computer alright so how do you assemble this um, Basically, you've got the uh, the body here, which actually has two pieces. This bottom stainless steel piece will unscrew, and you're going to need to unscrew that in order to put it together. So then you've got the uh, the cone and then the atomizer base. So what we'll do is we're going to go ahead and um, get out one of our atomizer heads here. So what we'll do to put this together is we'll take the, the base and there's a little slot right here. You can actually stick the atomizer head kind of right there. And then you'll just take the body and screw that right on top over the atomizer head. Make sure you get that nice and tight. And then that will lock it into place. Next thing you'll do is take the um, atomizer body, screw it onto the battery. And then finally, of course, the last thing that you will do is you can take out one of your cartridges. And you will, uh, as you can see, these do not come with e-liquid, so you will need to fill them prior to using them. All you got to do is pop off this little rubber cap. You will drip the e-liquid directly into the, uh, the tank cartridge here. What you want to do, though, is be sure to leave about a quarter of an inch um, of space. That way, when you put this cap back on it doesn't uh, cause the e-liquid to ooze all over the place so just make sure you leave a little bit of air gap there at the top when you fill it up so then you will just simply put the cap back on once it's all filled up and you will push this all the way down onto the uh, atomizer head and then um, basically that's all there is to putting the ego seat together um, <clears throat> it's a, a great electronic cigarette the great thing about it is instead of throwing out the whole atomizer um, whenever the atomizer head goes bad, you just take out the head, throw that part out, and you can put a new atomizer head on there, and you're ready to start vaping again. Um, whereas with the regular Ego, you have to replace the whole atomizer. Uh, if you have any further questions on the Ego C, feel free to give uh, me a call or shoot me an email, kevin at sharpsmoker.com. Thanks for watching this video, and have a great day.